Our soybean field has grown and is ready. Time to make some money. Hey, what's going on, everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Alan Grad here on Farming Simulator 19. Today, well, we've got one job. It is to harvest, harvest, and harvest some more. Our soybean field is ready to go, and we have our straw, uh, with the straw me mod. So we're going to be using soybean straw off of this field. Now, not only that, we may have to continue this video into like a version two, because I might have taken on four harvesting contracts, which is going to take us a little bit of time. And let's see, uh, fortunately, yeah, only two of them are going to the Felsburn grain mill. So I've got a pretty good idea about what I want to do with those. Hopefully we don't waste our time and money, but we'll we'll find out, won't we? We sure will. So what we're going to do, at least for right now, is harvest. So let's jump down to the ground, let's jump at our combine, and let's get to work. Overall, this should be a fairly easy job. So let's go ahead and get the combine unfolded. Let's go ahead and get this raised up a little bit. Soybean team seems to be a little bit high, and we'll turn our help window and make sure that straw soft is enabled which it is and then that's what well, that's about it <laughs> that's about all we need to do i'm gonna go ahead and alt zero this so that uh so that we can go ahead and take off with our working speed here there we go so we've got it unlocked and we are rocking so if you are curious about the mod that makes the straw drop out the back this is called straw me and it is a pc mod so those of you on pc you want to download this mod, check out the, the in-game mod hub, search for straw me, two words, and you'll be able to find it. What it does is it drops down your canola straw, your soybean straw, and corn straw. Oh, we missed some right there. All in one. That way you can pick these up and collect it later on and actually make a very good amount of income. As well as I believe it treats it as just standard straw in-game, which is pretty nice as well. So, oh, all in all, Highly recommend. I think this is a mod that all PC players should be using. So let's take uh, let's take the rest of this. Again, we don't really have a whole lot to do. It's get the work done, get the harvest done, and make as much money as we possibly can. There we go. We got a twist, and we are rocking. Oh boy, we're gonna be getting real close to that side. I might have harvested this a little bit too close. Yep, I think we're just a little bit too close on that. It's okay, it is what it is. What are you gonna do about it? So, let's talk about Alagrad a little bit. Let's talk about this map. In particular, I've had a really, really good time on Erlingrad. Erlingrad, Alagrad, I'm, it's gonna be different names. Um, I've got some ideas for kind of, ooh, that's a rock. Yep, back up, back up, back up, back up. Uh, I've got some ideas for kind of the way that I wanna go. I've got some ideas for the future of this map at least with within a the confines of being a series here on the channel um obviously we're going to be playing this for a little while a couple weeks or something like that so if you do enjoy man this is the stinkiest part because you get stuck right here on the edge um if this is a series that you enjoy if this is a map that you enjoy then that's good news you'll be able to see this for a little while we're going to be doing other stuff as well so it's not just Alan Grab, we're going to be doing other maps as well. As you know, we're doing, uh, it's not Blue Mountain Valley, is it? Nah, it's Bucks County, PA, Bucks County, Pennsylvania. Really, really enjoying that map. And it seems like a lot of you guys are as well. It's a very, very popular series. So we're just going to continue that as well. It's a PC map. It's available on console. It plays very good. Um, at the time of recording this video, which is a few days before this comes out, um, that has not received an update yet, so uh, I will be keeping you guys updated on the progress of that map to see what happens with it, because, <laughs> hey, we'll find out, right? Yes, we will. In the meantime, we have plenty of work to do here on Allengrad. I plan on getting this harvest done. We're going to try and maximize our cows. So we're maximizing contracts, we're maximizing what our cows can do. I would also like to buy a cultivator. I'll explain. I have... I'm going to have to do this first person. There we go. I have two more things that I have not done yet. Two achievements for Farming Simulator 19 that I have not accomplished. One of them is... I think it's either 
100 or uh, 50 contracts. I'm sure I've done over 50 contracts. Uh, so I think it's the 100 contracts thing. So I haven't done that. And I haven't done the cultivates, like cultivate 100 hectares or something like that. So I want to be able to do all of that. And, well, there's only one way to do that, and that's to work, 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 work. So we're going to be trying to maybe complete all of those as well, and maybe even do them in the same the same boat. So we'll get com or, uh, har <laughs> combining. We'll get cultivating contracts, knock two birds out one stone. Hopefully, hopefully all that works well. So I was about this. Let's go ahead and hit a few headlands. Let's get a little bit more work done on here. Let's see how well we could do here, because remember, we got a lot more work to go after this. So far, so good. Everything's rocking and rolling. We've done pretty well. We've got just a little bit left to do, to be completely honest with you. Let's go over here. I will show you exactly what we've got. So naturally, we have this entire area right here. However, you can see we've pretty much done the entire thing. It says there's, is there really a little bit left on there? I don't see anything. We'll just leave it be and let it be what it is. Now, one thing is our carting setup right here. We need a better carting setup. I think we need a bigger tractor is what we need. Um, this setup is about full. <laughs> it's about, it's about seeing its day, man. So that'll be that. Let's take a look at some prices real quick and see if selling is something we want to do. Um, I'm looking at supermarket. I'm seeing $2,600 per thousand liters. And I'm saying that's pretty good. That's a pretty decent price for soybeans. Uh, yeah, we're probably going to sell there almost immediately as soon as we're done with this. If we were in seasons, I'd probably hang on to it and wait till we get about three to $4,000 per thousand liters. But it is what it is at the end of the day. Okay, so I think that's pretty much full. We're good here. We've only got a little bit more to go. The Actually, the big money maker off of this field is going to be the straw. Um, I think we're going to make more money off of the straw than we will on the soybeans themselves. Only time's going to tell on that, but what I would like to do, here, here's what I want to do at the end of the day. I want to maximize our cows, so get as many cows as we possibly can. We can hold up to 50, so that's good. Um, that way, all we have to do is keep a continuous level of straw and hay and silage coming in. As long as we can keep doing grass work and that kind of thing, we will be good, at least on our cows. Our cows will make manure, they will make slurry and they will make, most importantly, milk. And all of those things we will sell and make money. Eventually, we will expand our cattle um, by selling that housing that we've got down there and reinvesting in a much, much larger area. So that one holds, I believe it's 50 cows, and the other in-game version, which we would very likely use, holds about 200, I believe. Unfortunately, the price just a little bit out of reach right now. If we go ahead and take a look real quick. Animals, cattle. Yeah, 300 grand. It's just a little bit high. <laughs> it's a little bit high for what it is. Tell you one thing that I was looking at, though. Chicken coop. This chicken coop right here, I looked at it the other day. It fits perfect right here. And we could maybe invest in some chickens and... Get, not only would we be able to get some chickens, so that'll hold, yeah, 100 chickens. Those 100 chickens could make us, yeah, quite a bit, I would say, of eggs. And we could take those eggs and sell and make some money. That would be another source of income. Now, with that source of income, we would need a steady stream of either wheat or barley. But yeah, that's pretty easy to do. I'm trying to stick with some more, more base game features here. I know, of course, we've got some pretty crazy mods that we're running for PC stuff, but I think the, the gameplay aspect of it, the things that we're using, I would like to keep uh, close-ish to base game if we could, or showcase alpine farming stuff. There's just some stuff that's too small, it's going to take forever, um, but other things, I think we could do some really neat stuff with it. So, uh, yeah, let's finish this field, at least for the time being, let's finish this field, and let's stick to plan A right now, which is maximize our cattle try and get as many as we possibly can uh fill that thing up and make the most manure slurry and milk that we possibly can to keep a steady stream of income coming into the farm that way we can continue to do contracts and work for our fellow farmers around i think that's a great thing yeah 
All right, let's keep rocking. Let's finish this build up. Field's done, and now it is time to sell. Our sell is going to be at the supermarket, and I gotta be honest with you, this is gonna be real interesting because check the way this is laid out. This is laid out, we kinda have to, yep, it's difficult. So let's see if we can actually make this happen. I'm sure we can. All right, we'll pull through. I hit something. That was a crash counter plus one if I've ever seen one. Move along now, move along. All right, so first off, we have our front trailer. Um, That's not good. Oh boy. That's, um, well, that's not right, is it? That's not right at all. That's our transport. Come on, man. Really? This is, this is, this is how we're going to do this? That's, so I can't make money until I get this transport mission done. That's what I'm hearing. Man, that stinks. Okay. All right. I'll play the game. I will, I will play along. Let's go back to our main farm, since we've already done some for for that. Uh, that's actually not good at all. Um, yeah, that's that's actually not good because we're gonna eh, it would be okay. Here's what we need to do. Where is our harvesting contract for the soybeans? Okay, it's gonna be on field 17. Field 17 can be found where? Right over here. Right at the very edge. Okay. Easy. Nice and easy. We'll grab our combine. We'll grab this. We'll take both of these bad boys over there. And we'll get that done. And then we can finally start making money off of our own soybeans. Thank you very much. Okay, let's do that. Well, we're on it. The game wants us to do this contract. So we're going to do this contract. And I tell you what. I'm doing this. Not a different way. but So I went started here. And I did a full headland. And I'm doing one run here down at the bottom, just like so. And now I'm just going to hire it on a worker right here and let the worker kind of do his thing back and forth, back and forth. So we should line it up even well with everybody else. So there's not a whole lot going on with this field. Um, I think it needs a few things. We're not picking up as much as I would have expected. So let's pick up something that I do expect to pick up, which is going to be... The straw swath. So we had mentioned this a few times previously. Don't have access to this field. Lol. All right, we're picking it up now. Yes, 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 yes. And we are getting a decent amount. Again, we're not going to get a huge amount to begin with, but at least we're going to get something. That's all that really matters to me at the end of the day is, do we get something? Yes. <laughs> well, then let's rock and roll, baby. Let's go. Let's pick this up, and then we'll continue along. Did I use this tractor for this purpose the last time around? Something about this feels much, much slower than before. Maybe I'm just used to going fast again. Who knows? Either way, um, but this is what we're going to do. This is what we're going to rock and roll. We're going to get all of this up, and this will give us some extra money. And everything else will as well. I think, I could be wrong here, but I think we should be able to afford, like, max cattle before the end of the day maybe it's just me <laughs> who knows hey but i'm gonna try it's a good uh good goal it's good goal yeah good job dj as it sits now maybe we're about halfway finished with this we've got just north of seventy thousand liters of soybean straw and we've got just north of ten thousand liters of soybeans in general uh, right through here, I'm expecting to get somewhere around 12 or so. We'll take a look. There is some left in there that I was not able to get. I'll tell you what, I like this truck. It's quick, but I think maybe sometime we, we might invest in... Uh, I, don't, I don't know if a truck would be a good idea. No, maybe a smaller semi-truck, something like that. We're really not working with a lot, as it says right now. Really not working with a ton of crop. Yeah. Actually, I think, yeah, should be able to get the rest of that done by himself. We'll go ahead and jump back in here. Tell you what, though, this looks really good. Just look at that for a second. All right. Seconds up. Let's go. All right. So as you can see right here, we got 73,000 liters of soybean straw. This is going to make us quite a bit of money. If we go in, well, actually, first, if we take a look, it looks like a little soybean right beside a straw bale. If we take a look at that, we're looking at $291 per thousand liters right now, which ain't too bad. It's not too bad, but... When you look at that, it's, it's yeah, I think we're going to do okay. I don't think anymore. 
Look at that price. Because usually that price is pretty good. I don't think we're going to make the amount of money that I was expecting. I think that we're going to make maybe about half. Yeah, I think about half is probably good. We'll make about half as much off of the straw as we will off of the soybean itself. But that's still pretty good. And plus, off of this, we don't really make much money off of the soybean. We just make money off the contract and what little there is left. Also, I have a game plan for contracts. Probably going to have to do that in the next video as this one's going to run, I think, just a little bit too long to be able to show that off. But we've got two more contracts, actually three more contracts after this one. And those are going to be contracts that are going over to the Felsburn Grain Mill. I think I've got a game plan and it's to not sell the crop that we have harvested. So when you set it off on the uh, on that, it says, you know, do this, do that. I think maybe don't sell, I think. Either that or I'm gonna have to find a way around that because harvesting contracts, especially them sending off to Fells or Green Mill, that is pretty tough when you don't make any cash off the extra. That's just really, really tough. So I've got to figure all that out. So the contract is finished, but it's not over, if that makes any sense. We still have our straw in here and we still have the soybeans in front of us right there. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm going to go ahead and we're, we're gonna do like a big money making thing all at once. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Let's take this first. Let's head over to our main farm. I'm gonna pick up all of the soybean straw there. So then we should have a good estimate of how much soybean straw we're gonna get. We're gonna sell it all at once. Then we're going to go over and we're going to fill up the rest of our tippers with soybeans so that we've got the most amount of soybeans that we could get. Also, I don't know if I showed this off, but we got strobe lights on here. It's really cool. Um, so that way we're going to do one big money making thing all at once. So we'll have our soybean straw. We'll have our soybeans. We'll make a ton of money. Hopefully be over a hundred thousand. Oh, please be over a hundred thousand, man. Ugh, look at the soybean straw from back here. It does not look good. Yikes. I even have everything like turned up to the max. Yikes. All right, let's, let's cut across here. It's not going to matter. We're going to buy all this land eventually anyway. Are we? Yeah, that's not a bad, not a bad plot of land to buy. Okay, cool. Let's pick this up. Then we're going to do the same thing with the soybeans. I will meet you at supermarket and barn when this is all finished. Guess whose game crashed? Yeah, let's jump in. I got to do all that again, man. Um, yep. <laughs> totally, bro. Really do. I have to do all of that again. I have to harvest. I have to. Do oh, man, that's going to stink. Okay, let's go back over here. Go to contracts. Let's find our. Ay, 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 ay. Let's see this. Let's. Oh, this stinks, doesn't it? It sure does. Build 17. All right, accept the contract. Uh, we had a few other ones, so I'm going to try and go through and find the ones that we had. Let's see. There's one. That was definitely not one that I took. Uh, let's see. Harvesting oats. I believe that was one. So. We have barley, oats, soybeans. We had a canola field as well, didn't we? Yeah, I thought we did. Canola field. Where's that at? Cultivating, harvesting, fertilizing, fertilizing, harvesting. Nope. Nope. Canola. I think that was it. Okay. Let's do all that again. That stinks. That stinks a whole lot. I'm, uh... Well, the great thing about PC is... Well, eh. When, when something crashes. Yep. You got to use this, don't you? Well, after, uh, I would say, I think about 20 IRL minutes, something like that. We're back to where we were. Uh, we've been recording this video now well over two hours. It's a great, great time to be alive. Yes, it is. Okay, so here's what we need to do. Because my game crashed a second time. Just try and try and try and didn't work very well. Here's what we have. We have all the soybeans. All of the soybeans. We still have some more in here as well. We got 21,944 left in there. We'll just kind of slowly start making our rounds. But as you can see, supermarket is the best price or best place to sell them. Period. 
And I got something else. Yeah, I'm not gonna use the in-game stuff again. No, it's not happening. What I will do, however, is sell this. So let's go and sell the soybean straw. This should kick this out pretty quick. Yeah, $77,000 for that. Very, very good. I'm actually working on a contract over there and yeah, I'm using this. I'm, I was gonna do all this. It's not happening. Uh -uh. <laughs> but what we can do is go ahead and dump some of this. Now, I'm not worried about this. Generally, when you sell your, uh, sell your contract stuff, you're worried about making sure that you don't sell too much of it, especially in seasons. However, here, this is the best price. So uh, this is exactly what we're gonna be going for. Hopefully we can kind of go here in an angle. We should see our uh, contract finished, yeah. Contract finished right there. That's going in, so that's good. Let's go ahead and take our contract. Let's find the completion, and we will go and collect from that. And uh, then we made quite a bit off of that as well, and we've got more than two loads left. So, I say more than two, more than one? Yeah, we got more than one load, and we only have one load. You know what? That made me feel good. Basan coming in for the second round of sales. Let's go ahead and start the first one here. So this just shows you, yes, you can sell here at the supermarket. I'm sure there's quite a few of you guys that are going to be going with trailer setup similar to this one, as this is extremely popular, especially on Felsbrin. Ravenport, not so much, um, but this is extremely popular on Felsbrin. Well, you get the exact same trailer, just set up differently. It's a chrome or silver trailer instead of a green trailer works just fine for me i actually like this setup doesn't hold a lot but it looks good so there's that and we've got over two hundred thousand dollars that's absolutely incredible and we're not even done yet we've got a little bit more i think we have uh either a couple hundred or maybe a thousand liters left something like that let's go ahead and close up the back trailer because we're not going to be using that one anymore here comes the last bit right here and the last bit right here we've got 444 liters giving us cool $1,164 which is great so at the end of it we've got $207,000 to mess with we do have a couple contracts I'm gonna go ahead and complete those off screen because we made way more money than I was expecting thus later on we should have a good opportunity to spend some of that money can't make money without spending money so we're going to be spending it but that's going to be the next time that we're here we're also going to be getting this mode up as well that way we can get some more hay and get some more silage because we're gonna have a whole lot more cows oh yeah but until then that is going to be it for today i hope you enjoyed if you did make sure you drop a like on it get subscribed to the channel if you're new and join the go ham fam make sure you turn your notification bells on as well so that you never miss daily farming simulator videos here on the channel Love you, Ted. Hope you have a great day. We'll see you later. Peace.